hey everyone welcome back to my channel i hope that you are doing fine and well and i hope that um you had a good week uh it's almost uh, eight o'clock in the evening and uh i planned to do a 24 hour read -a -thon, um now on monday and um i'm gonna start it at midnight so i had a nap during the afternoon and everything to make sure that i was going to survive the night because just the beginning of the night between um midnight and maybe eight o'clock in the morning will be the p harder part for me but uh hopefully i will get through it let's see so uh i'm going to do now the selection of uh, a number a certain number of books three or four books that will uh, let me go through the night uh, because I don't want to disturb my husband uh, while he's asleep and my books are all in my room so I'm gonna make the selection uh, of these books um, and I'm gonna use the relator for it I've done a special pilot just for this readathon so um, this pile is nothing to do with the monthly um, and weekly um, DPRs that I do so it's a completely separated pile for it um i hope i um gonna to enjoy the books i selected i select all uh, audiobooks for i can read and listen when i am more tired because uh, it's gonna be very hard for me but i, I hope i'm gonna survive and that uh, everything is gonna be fine so let's let's roll and here we are in each cup we have a paper some cups are empty they don't have anything because uh, I, don't, I didn't need it to fill up all of them but the ones i have they are more than enough for 24 hours i have less than books so it is more than enough so um let's go for a roll and see what I am going to pick it up. At this moment, I'm just gonna pick it up enough for to get me through the night. For I don't need to come to the room and disturbing my husband while he's asleep. Um, I'm gonna try not to sleep, but I can't promise anything. So um, let's go for the first roll. Oh, sorry, sorry guys. Stuck it on my fingers. Number 11. Do I have some... A cup? Do I have... Yes, I do. Number 11. Oh, Diana. Hi, Diana. Okay. Okay, uh, I wasn't expecting uh, uh, this book to come out, honestly. Uh, this is Diana. This is the story of the Princess Diana and um, what happened to her and everything. And um, I am quite excited to, to read the book, actually. And um, I wasn't really expecting to, to come out. So uh let's see I, I might leave for the last because uh it will be probably emotional story so i might leave, leave for last from the three four books i will choose just because um it will be probably emotional or or something so um let's see let's see if i will enjoy it or not Okay, now let's go for the next roll. Fifteen. Fifteen. Ah, oh, sorry guys. Fifteen is an empty cup. So I have to roll again. Oh, really? Oh, 
what happens when you have empty cups. Ah, six. I hope I have a 16 with, ah, yes, I do have a 16 with paper in. Oh, Kingdom of Pack. Okay, second book is Kingdom of Pack by Mary Lou. Uh, the only thing I know about this book is this is its own Mozart story. So I am quite intrigued of what it's about and if I will like it. Um, so let's see what I am thinking, what I'm going to think about the book. Okay, let's go for a, ra a last roll for now, just for to get me through the night and mm, to make sure that I don't disturb my husband. Obviously, that's the last thing I want. If I get, I want to make sure that if I get in in a room, it's to sleep. But I will try to avoid that. Nine. Sorry. Nine is saying pick up. I have to roll again. Two. Oh, yes. Number two, half a paper. And the third book is White Sarcasso C. And it had come out the classic White Sarcasso C by Shane Reigns. Reigns? By Shane Reigns. I don't know how to pronounce the last surname. So, surname, so. Um, I don't know nothing about this book. A, a friend of my um, advised it to me, and she said that is very good. But she likes classics. I don't like classic that much, so I am quite nervous to read this classic. So this is the books that will get me through tonight: Diana, King of Park, and White, Sar White Sarcasso Sea. I hope. I gonna enjoy it. Um, I'm gonna try, but try very hard to finish them uh, during the night. But I can't promise because King of the Moth Pack is around ten hours, so it will take me five hours to read them on speed two. So five hours will be, for, for example, if I start with that, will be uh, until five in the morning. And Diana is around 14 hours of audiobook, so that will be around 7 hours. If I start with that, will be at, until 7 in the morning. With no breaks, nothing whatsoever. So I'm pretty sure that this tree will get me through at least 10 in the morning, maybe 11. <clears throat> 12 o'clock if I do the breaks. So... I am quite excited, uh, I'm really happy, and let's see uh, what I think about the books and what they are about, and i see you at midnight. Here I am, and it's definitely not midnight, it's 6 o'clock in the morning, so I am pretty much a bit late. But uh, I prefer to be a, to have a rest because as a key worker, I I always need to be ready for a shift that is not on my schedule in case someone can go sleep or something. So um, I don't don't really mind that the fact that I slept. But um, here I am to actually to do, and I'm gonna start with Kingdom of Bag by Mary Lou. I'm not gonna start it with. The, um, the classic um, White Sarcasso C because I don't know, it's a classic uh, I'm not very keen for classics I can notice that so I don't really know um, I will see I will read uh, The King of the Moth back and uh, I will see if I want to read uh, a White Sarcasso C or not I will let you know later. Um, I'm back <laughs> after 10 hours. 
no not quite not quite because i think it was six in the morning last time i talked with you and it's four in the afternoon so almost at least eight hours and i finally finished the kingdom of back by marie lou and i cave i'm kidding a four a five stars it is amazing i really love it i love the way the world is building the description of the world and the characters everything i really enjoy it and i really love it so the kingdom of back it's about the mozart family and how uh, mozart and his sister um, composed the musics that we know today and how they um survive the family and everything else and i really enjoy it and i really love it i really recommend it because it's a re a great book and i i really love it and i really enjoy it to uh, listen to the audiobook for it the audiobook is awesome it's very very good for my next reading i am going to do diana Piadru mordon Andrew, Andrew Morton and um, I have no idea as you can see if I'm gonna finish today I hope so by m my calculations um, I'm not gonna finish today even raining non-stop I'm not gonna finish today but I'm gonna try uh, and I've been thinking and I'm gonna extend it the rift on for tomorrow too. So instead of stopping at midnight like I should, I'm gonna stop around 10 in the evening of tomorrow. So at least like this I can read more and I actually can do 24 hours. And uh, like this it will be uh, way better. So um, I am extending for tomorrow i think it's easier for me if i do the 24 hours read done in two days so now i'm going to read diana and uh, after i will let you know which book is gonna be next if i finish today if not i will talk with you tomorrow it's nine in the evening and i'm uh into a page 120 of diana so um and i am quite enjoying the story and see how hard it was for her uh, to be the princess and all that stuff that ha was happening to her and uh all that messed up life that is if we on the royal with the rules and the all that things that she needs to follow and to do, the places she needs to be, and she didn't know how to be a princess, and it was really hard for her. And I am really enjoying the book and get to know a bit more about her. In the meantime, I try White Rakasu Sea by Jean Rims. And I didn't, didn't enjoy it at all. I had to DNF it because uh, after a few pages, I just lost the interest. I just lost the uh, willing to read. Uh, I didn't get the story or what was happening. I didn't get much of the story because I just really read a few pages that I gave up. So, um... I just uh, not into I try to find the audiobook to see if I could pick it up the interest but I couldn't find the audiobook and um, I just lost the willing on reading it so uh, I just didn't have it uh, I will anyway put the the book on uh, description on the list of books that I done during this readathon just for the sake of it but uh, I will DNF it because I didn't like I didn't like it and um, I just lost the interest on it. So uh, I am keep going with the reading. I want to see if I get at least on page two hundred. This still today. I don't know if I can do it. 
hopefully yes i can at least page 200 i want to reach today i might go to bed a little bit um tomorrow i have a few stuffs to do but i am uh, extending the read it until tomorrow so um it will be fun and uh, let's see if I can at least finish this book and read another one. I'm on a hope of that. Let's see what I can do. I'm gonna stop my reading for today. I'm very tired and I read all day so um, I'm gonna stop reading for today. I'm on page 190 on the um, Diana book. So I I read quite a bit of the book and I'm really enjoying the book, but I am gonna stop. Um, and I'm gonna have a rest. I read almost a book and a half, but for me it's very good, and I will finish the book of Diana tomorrow. So I will see you tomorrow morning, very early. Good morning everyone and here we are for the second day of 24 hours readathon. I had a good sleep, I can tell that. It's at this moment half past nine. I already read a little bit of the book, not much. Uh, I'm just doing a quick update. I have to leave at the moment. I need to drop at work for a few stuff I have to do. But um, uh, it's no no big deal and i will take just a few minutes and after i will be back and i will return to the book i am doing i am planning for at least finish diana i'm halfway through and i'm really enjoying i was really afraid to read this book because um i'm not a big fan of non-fiction but this one is very, very good. I'm enjoying it so much. And um, I am um, I am just to drop at work. And after I will be back and I will finish the book. Um, I am going to try to uh, finish this morning. But I doubt it. I'm not going to promise. But I'm going to try because on the afternoon I want to read something else, at least. So let's see uh, if I can do it or not. Um, and I will let you know later what I'm going to do in the afternoon. It's 8 o'clock in the evening. My hair is wet. I put it tight here because, um, because of the headphones. They hurt me, but I'm going to release it a little bit. So, I arrived home around 12 o'clock, I done lunch, I had lunch, I, I watched a little bit of telly, and after I went to the book, in the meantime I, I stopped a little bit, and I had a shower, as you can see my wet hair, and I finally finished Diana by Andrew Morden, and I absolutely love it i'm giving it five stars it's absolutely gorgeous the book uh, i really recommend it uh, this book to everyone it's gorgeous and it's beautiful it speaks about her in a unique way and it's just really reading the book you will understand what i'm talking about and i i really love it so I had three books, I read two, the other one I didn't have it because I didn't like it and I got, I'm getting to the conclusion that I don't like classics that much. So I'm gonna stop to read, to trying to read classics because I tried several times with Little Women and blah 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 and I don't like it. The only classics that I'm, I kind of like it it's the gothic ones normal classics romance especially i don't like it at all so i'm giving up of trying to read classics so white sarcasso sea by jean reams 
I didn't have it, so I can't give stars, and I didn't like it. The first one that I finished was the Kingdom of Back Bad Mary Lou, and I give a five stars. And after Tiana by Andrew Morton, and I give a five stars. So I think I had a quite very good readathon. Two books, two five stars. So it was really good, I think. Um, so I hope you did enjoy it. Uh, I hope you did like it. Thank you so much for watching. I and I hope that I will see you next time. Uh, I am. That's why I like so much to do the readathons. I am almost on a thousand pages. I'm currently on seven hundred and fifty pages. So I'm almost there. I'm so happy that I'm almost there. Um, one, I already done the numbers. One more book, and I will be there. And I, uh, I have um, on my TBR at least two books that I want to read. So um, I am really happy, and uh, I. I'm super excited that this week I am going to reach 2,000 pages. If nothing, out of the schedule will happen. Hopefully, the truth. Uh, <laughs> and uh, thank you so much for watching. Um, and I see you next time. Bye.